It's 2021. We are heading into 2022. And if you've been working from home from your work laptop, you are able to work in different places in the house. It is completely mobile. And when working on projects or even day-to-day -day activities, the monitor starts to feel a little small, the keyboard feels a little bit cramped, and you're not feeling as productive or effective. It has been okay for the short term, and now it's turning into a long-term affair. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to turn your work laptop into a desktop computer setup. Hi, YouTube. My name is Ryan and this is the Elevate Project. If you find value in this video, don't forget to hit that like button, comment below and consider subscribing. The reality is for most people, working from home is the new normal. Before I show you how to turn your work laptop into a desktop computer, let's talk about why you may want to do this. You've probably been working from home for probably over a year now and you've set up routine and a place in your home as a dedicated work area. This means your laptop is most likely plugged in 90 to 90% 90 of the time. If you're watching this video, you probably are working directly off your laptop, which over time the screen does start to feel a bit cramped and typing however might be fine depending on the type of work you do. For some work, it would be easier to type having a number pad or at least the ability to move the keyboard further away from the screen for better ergonomics. Using the trackpad is great for most things and having a dedicated mouse makes it easier when working for hours upon hours every single day. A laptop, in my opinion, is great for working in short durations where you aren't spending six to eight hours a day, five days a week. Thinking about a dedicated desktop computer, you have a monitor that works for you and a keyboard and mouse that gives you the freedom to type and scroll and multitask on your screen. A desktop computer will have a variety of ports to connect peripherals that provide you in most cases more ports than a laptop. For example, you can connect a dedicated webcam and mic for better video and audio for Zoom meetings and the ability to unplug that webcam when not in use in case someone is watching. You can also connect an external hard drive and multiple monitors to help improve your workflow and a dedicated ethernet port to get the most of your home internet. It is easy to understand why having a dedicated desktop setup makes it easier for long-term use when working day after day from the same desk or work area. A great thing about a work laptop, you can easily turn it into a desktop computer setup at home and on days you want to change the environment, you can disconnect from your monitor and keyboard and work anywhere for shorter periods of time without strain. So let's show you how to turn your laptop into a desktop setup. Fundamentally, a desktop computer is the brain and you need to connect a monitor, keyboard and mouse to see and navigate and use the computer as intended. So depending on your work laptop, you might have all the ports on your laptop in order to do this. Most keyboard and mouses today are wireless and most work laptops have Bluetooth or wireless technology built in. The main port or connection you're gonna be looking for is how to connect an external monitor to your laptop to complete the conversion. Depending on the monitor you currently have or thinking about purchasing will determine the port you are gonna be looking for on your laptop. Most newer or modern monitors will connect either through a display port or an HDMI port or a USB-C port. Older connections or legacy ports that can connect to older monitors are VGA or DVI ports. Most monitors have different options to connect to a computer. And if your laptop doesn't have the port or connection you will have to purchase an adapter or a dongle to make it work. Adapters are going to range in price depending on additional ports that the adapter provides, which in most cases you can find an inexpensive adapter to simply connect your monitor. Then you can either use your laptop keyboard and trackpad or connect a wireless keyboard and mouse through a Bluetooth or through a standard USB-A port. 
Once you have that done, your laptop can be used as a desktop commuter in two different ways. One, with the screen laptop off or with your laptop lid closed, which then you will see all your work on one display. Second, you have the option of having dual displays with your laptop screen open, where you can either mirror the display or have two dedicated displays and have a larger work area, which can be very effective for multitasking. If you don't have all the ports to connect at least an external monitor, keyboard and mouse, or you need more ports to connect other devices, you will need to get a dongle or hub that will accommodate all the different devices to your laptop. For example, if you own a newer MacBook, MacBook Pro, or Air, they typically only have USB-C or Thunderbolt 3 ports, which means you will absolutely need an adapter or hub to connect to an external display. Because this is your work laptop, it wouldn't be a bad idea to see if your work will be able to provide an adapter or even a monitor to have a seamless desk setup for your work laptop working from home. I was fortunate enough to have my work provide a dongle that connected to my work MacBook Air to connect to an external monitor, also power, and a couple USB-A ports through only one wire. That is all it really takes, and with a little time, you can have your work area desk set up to your needs to be more productive and efficient working long hours. Now, if you need even more ports, I actually have a CalDigit TS3 Plus that I use for my personal laptop that has additional ports like an Ethernet jack, a Thunderbolt 3 port, an SD card reader, optical port to connect to a sound bar or a sound system, and a head jack. Yes, a headphone jack. This is an amazing hub that sits on my desk and connects to my MacBook Pro through one single wire. So when you think about it, that will help you set up everything that you need to set up to your computer or connect to your computer for today and tomorrow. So these are some simple ways to turn your laptop into a desktop or a desktop setup for a seamless, dedicated work office working from home. If you found value in this video, hit that like button. I would absolutely appreciate it. Comment below and let me know your desk setup and what you have connected to your laptop to make it into a desktop. If you like content like this one, consider subscribing and hit the subscribe button and hit the bell so you get notified the next time I upload another video. Thanks everyone and I will catch you in the next one.